Hey everyone, this is Holly with The Crafty Attic, and I am here to show you what supplies you'll need to make the new Craze Crushed Tin Can Pockets. These are what they look like, and it's just a used tin can of any size. That's the one. This is another that I've done. Any size tin can will work. These were actually soup cans, so they're pretty small. But anyway, let's see. So, there's two kinds of bottoms on the tin cans. One, the bottom and the top look the same. On this particular can, it's rounded so that you can stack them in your cupboard. It's impossible to get the bottoms off these, so these won't work as far as I know. I haven't found an opener that will open them. So you'll start with your can and you'll want to get most of the glue and label and everything off of it. Open up the top and the bottom and you'll step on this can to crush it. You're going to want to put your, your foot on the entire can to start. And then once you've got it somewhat crushed, you'll go to the bottom and close it. This is the start. So the, oh, the top is still somewhat open, kind of an oval shape. The bottom is somewhat closed. And this one, I've already painted this, but I took it to the garage and stuck it in my husband's vise. Squeeze it closed. You, you probably really can't use these for live plants because it is still somewhat open and you couldn't water these. But anyway, so I've already painted this can. That's the opening I'm going to be working with. And the spray paint I use is the Krylon Chalky Finish Paint. This one I found is the best. It dries quick, no runs. And because we're going to add napkins to these, I've only done one coat just to cover most of the silver. The napkin will take care of the rest. So, okay, so you need your can, the spray paint, Mod Podge. I use foam brushes to apply. Um, and some designer napkins of your choice. These are some I recently purchased. Cute ones. It's kind of a patriotic napkin. These I can't wait to try. They resemble denim with the flowers. And some sunflowers with lavender. I love yellow and purple together. Anyway, um, you will need some just cheap plastic wrap. You don't have to buy the name brand. I'm using great value. This is a water pen and this will be used to tear the napkin apart, give it kind of a rough edge so that it blends in with the paint. And you can get those at Hobby Lobby. I believe I ordered this pack from Hobby Lobby. Only, you only really need one unless you're going to do this with a group. And what else? Final coat. I use the DuraClear matte varnish from Deco Art, and this just really seals everything up. So anyway, everybody gather their supplies, and I'll make several follow-up videos to teach you how to do these cans. Okay, thanks everyone. We'll see you soon.